Hey y'all. Okay, I was gonna come and show y'all. I kind of got this a little bit cleaned up, but I noticed I needed to really get some cleaning done. Let me show you what is going on. Do you see that? Do you see those half dead areas? <laughs> Well, I didn't even know. I had just come up here like two days ago. And I come up here yesterday. And the black blister bugs were just covered all over. And they wiped out quite a bit of... Let me see. If any are back. I tried to knock them all down and squish them. But they did a number of damage. Yep. You see them? Oh, let me take it off this tripod and show y'all. Look at this. Those little turds. They just devoured the whole plant. And you don't want them to bite you. Oh, it hurts. Yeah, those little things. That's a black blister bug right there. And this is what they do to your plant. They kill them. I didn't know they were over here because we had got behind on the mowing. And the little stinks had just really tore up a lot of this. I had really nice, healthy plants considering I had um, white flies and aphids. Ugh. Yuck. Sorry. I'm not meaning to jostle you guys around like that. But I wanted to show you the damage they do. Look at that. And then they, they wipe out the uh, the blossoms too. If they can get up in that bag, they'll eat the tomatoes too. Or they'll just start cutting into the tomato. So aggravating. And then they leave this black poop all over the place. And here's a couple more. I'm gonna try and get them before they do any more damage. Gracie, quit. Let's see if I can knock it onto here and then I can move them. You should have seen how many were on here yesterday. It's horrible. with them but hey I had to do what I had to do sorry airplanes go by we're not too far from the airport so I kind of got up behind for a couple days on bagging the blooms or bagging the buds before they bloom and I guess the blister bugs saw their opportunity and just really got up here and started killing my stuff so aggravating because this is one of the rough woods or these two varieties are rough woods that I needed to collect seeds for and so I just needed to get up here and get these things bagged and instead of getting all that done I had to deal with the blister bugs and then the ragweed got out of control This is a really pretty rough wood. I mean, it'll get a real pretty reddish pink. Very good flavor, because you can see I missed a few getting them bagged. So, now let's catch up. I'm allergic to that ragweed, and so it's really affected my allergies. that room. Try to get all these done. The secret is to stay on top of this. If you get behind for a day or two, then you get tomatoes. And I'd rather have the seeds 
because you can still use the tomatoes. You can just take the seeds out and still use the tomatoes so you're not wasting any food. But not very many of these made it on this row, so I want to make sure I bag every available blossom possible. Yeah, look at that. And then <clears throat> I had a few that were in the garden just the regular tomatoes and I wanted to save the seeds for some of the varieties in the garden as well and I had one finally because everything's late this season I had one bag tomato and a stupid cutworm had got in there and just ate one whole half of that tomato I was so mad the pests have been just a uh, a huge problem this year. Well, it's been that way for the last few years. You don't quite know what to do. This ecosystem is so damaged. I've tried to research how to restore it naturally. I've been pretty unsuccessful. But that's what happens when we get behind. So I wanted to kind of show you what has been going on and it's pretty frustrating and aggravating. Let me show you. There's another blister bag, but see the black poop they leave everywhere? And if the plant doesn't get nutrients, then you don't get these You want to get them bagged at this point and right when they're coming up. <clears throat> I apologize, my allergies are bothering me really bad. I'm really allergic to the ragweed. Really, a lot of stuff. Doggone it. I can't believe they did that. That's pretty. Right here is the best time to go ahead and bag right there but that one's already got one open so I'm gonna not bag that one look what they did darn it that is so aggravating that one hasn't opened up yet so I can go ahead and bag that one Okay, y'all, I hope y'all are having a better growing season than I am. And I will talk to you later.